guys, good afternoon. Uh, this is Teacher Seppi. Uh, one of my followers sent me this uh, question and I decided to take video of myself explaining this because uh, uh, after uh, when I read this question, this is really uh, common questions that you can see in that in Gen uh, was let Gen Ed Mathematics and Civil Service and Napolcom. So, yun, ayun siya. I'll be explaining this one. So, let's start with this. Like, if each side of a square is increased by 4 cm, its area becomes 144 centime uh, square centimeters. And then, find the original measures of the sides. Okay, ayun siya. Now, since the, the area of the square, formula first, which is S squared, or the square of the sides. And it says there that a square, okay, square, uh, square of the sides. So, shall I say this is a square? Let, we let X for each side, okay? Because we don't know the original, uh, the measure of the original sides of the square, original square. So, S squared, so that means our area here is X squared. But since it says here, if we're going to increase each side by 4 centimeter, its area becomes 144 centimeter. So, we say, so this one becomes X plus 4, X plus 4, X plus 4, and X plus 4, okay? Now, the new area is equal to S squared, same formula. Since the side now becomes X plus 4, we say X plus 4, okay? And then you square that. Uh, and then, since the new area also says that it's 144 centimeter, okay? So there we go. Now, uh, we're just going to have this one. One, I uh, no, no. I'll just interchange this. So we have X plus 4 squared is equal to 144, okay? There we go. Now, in this case, we're just going to take the square root of both sides square root of both sides. Pag mag-square yung sa kabila, take lang natin yung square root. That's how easy it is at in solving, solving this kind of problem. Kasi, uh, pag expand nyo pa to, x plus 4 times x plus 4, it will just take your time and it takes really, really very long and there can be a big possibility that you will uh, arrive at the wrong answer. So, we'll just have if this is squared and this is a perfect square number in the other side. Just take the square root. That's it. Okay? So, cancel this one. So, we have x plus 4. Now, uh, usually, we put positive and negative here. But the thing is, we are dealing with distances or measurements. We don't uh, use negative. So, we just have to use the positive here, okay? There we go. So, we have square root of 144 is 12, okay? Now, solving this, transposing that, so we have here x is equal to 12 minus 4. x is equal now to 8, okay? So, this is the original measure of the side of the original uh, square which is 8 centimeters okay so take note of this kind of problem if each side of a square is increased by 4 centimeter its area becomes 144 square centimeters find the original measures of the sides so it's 8 okay as i've said uh, all you need to do is just to uh, familiarize all those basic geometric areas um Geometric areas and, and, and surface areas and what more. Volumes of basic geometric figures uh, for you to, to uh, solve this um, kind of problem. Because actually we have we have nine types of problems. I'll begin to discuss each one of them. So for now, I'll, I'll just I'll leave it to you to, to, to study this. And uh, if you can, try to find some exercises on the internet, okay? So, I hope this helped you guys. This is Teacher Seppi. Bye-bye.